Hi, this is Redan. I hope you are doing well. Welcome back with another video. In this video, I'm gonna tell you how to download plugins with two methods free, not costly. Okay, so let's start. Come on your WordPress dashboard, click on plugins and uh, click on add new from here search your plugin for example i want to download a plugin to customize my website so elementor is one of the best plugin from here you can see uh, an elementor website builder the Elementor website builder has its all track and draw page builder, pixel design, mobile responsive editing, and more. So, if you want to know about more details, click on more details and you can uh, see from here all the details about this plugin. You can see installations WordPress 5.0 or creator php version and mysql and you can also see a screenshot that actually how it works okay from here okay and you can also uh, you have to notice also this this have four and half star it means it's good this one have five star but here uh, this four and header and footer Okay, and for menu for widgets and library. So click on install now. You can also see other um, by scroll down. You can see five star, five star, and but this is all for other purpose. Okay, it's installing. Okay, good. It's installed. Click on active. And the plugin is active now. Okay. This is the first method. And the second method, go to your Google and type the plugin name, whatever you want to download or uh, install. If the plugin is not shown in your WordPress. Type is Elementor Download Okay, from here you can see a download button over here uh, As you can see, start downloading so as it's download, go to your go to your dashboard and click uh, go in plugins. Click on add new. Click on upload plugin, and you can choose file from here. The as you can see the Elementor over here. Click on it. Click on open. Okay, click on it and click on open. As you can see, I know it's not a uh, elementor, I'm just uh, telling you how to do it. As you can see, the file is done. You click, you have to click on install now. As, as it install, click on active and it will appear on here. Okay, so for me, go to uh, as you can see the element over here, go to the elementor. And you have to do some changes not for all elementor not for all plugins but for some you have to be under that out you have to enter some info or something like that or you have to log in but not for all okay you can see all details over here so i hope this video helps you if you have any curious question ask me in comment i will help you don't forget to subscribe 